This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to do lab assault lightning hardcore with a gesture. You need a Kraken cannon, right? When you spawn in, you're going to shoot through the uh, railing here and get the crystal down. Keep in mind, you want to get a uh, pretty good Kraken cannon for this. Lower stat ones probably won't cut it. Once you're done with that first one, you're going to follow my route here. It might take you a few jumps to get past that railing. Once you're done with that, go take this route and jump over this side and jump on top of this railing right here. Then shoot this next crystal from underneath. Um, you're going to be actually shooting the crystal after this one. Uh, in around the same area as well, because the cannon has apparently no range uh, maximum. You're just going to sit around this area right here and shoot it far away. I've zoomed in so you can see it easier. Try to shoot between the railing there, but you should be fine. Um, you might want to open up your map every once in a while, just to make sure you're actually damaging it. But once it's done, just follow this route. Careful to dodge the ogre spitball. Shoot this one, it's pretty self explanatory. Just shoot to the enemy, you'll get splash damage. Um, and then for this area here, make sure you're standing around the area where I am. Don't be on that curve, otherwise it doesn't end well. Uh, I spawned in my extra characters, as you can see there. But uh, yeah, I'm just going to speed up the video soon. Because uh, the next part of it is just kind of waiting for the EVs to spawn. Now this is why you want a lot of damage, because you're going to be dealing a lot of damage. It's like 20 million HP per EV. There's 20 EVs. That's about, what, 400 million damage you're going to have to do. Just keep shooting at them, try to make sure they don't get piled up on this right side, because if they do, you'll have a lot of problems. As you can see, a lot of them are committing suicide, but that's just because they can't handle your high stats. Um, that's just, uh, you know, it's something you got to deal with, but either way, just keep hitting them. And make sure they don't get too close to you, because they do a lot of damage on uh, Nightmare. They might get stuck every once in a while, but uh, as long as you shoot them, they, they probably move away from where they are. As you can see, we're on the last two right here. Uh, they'll they'll generally just uh, jump off if they're not feeling it, and if they get stuck like this one did, just keep shooting at it. If you get a bit closer to it, it might actually just decide to jump off on its own. Really depends on how it's feeling that day. And there you go. That's the map completed. And now I'm going to show you my stats. Again, keep in mind, really high stats is what you want for this. I've trained a lot to get these uh, stats. Level 78, as you can see them as they are right here. Um, the secondary weapon I have here is just useful for the right click in case they get stuck in a specific spot. They didn't this time. And the Kraken Ken is the centerpiece. You want to really have high stats on this weapon. And yeah, thanks for watching.